in this lesson we are going to cover uh, basic settings such as dimensioning units and working units for the project so let's start with dimensioning units so we go up here under options project preferences and select dimensions with dimensions selected we have this so you can see here we have selected dimensions and we have these options that are here we have plane meter we have plane millimeter us architect and us builder so i'm i'm working using the international version and in my country we use millimeters for drawing so based on uh, the country that you are coming from and the standards that are applicable there make sure to select the most appropriate dimensioning units for this project so for me i will select plain millimeter and down here we have uh, linear dimensions the unit is millimeter and we the decimals we have zero decimal places and the accuracy extra accura accuracy is turned off and the witness line scalability we have fixed scale selected then click ok so that is how to to change the dimensioning units so for the working units we go to options again project preferences we select working units so working units we have units for each uh, unit of measurement so the length unit for me is set as millimeter you have options for meter decimeter centimeter millimeter and inches that is depending on uh, depending on uh, on the standards in your country so we have length units as millimeters with zero decimal places we have the area units given in terms of uh, square meters i want to have that with zero decimal places we have the volume unit given in terms of uh, cubic meters and i also want to have this in uh, zero decimal places we have the angle unit We'll give that in terms of uh, decimal degrees we have the layout unit the layout unit is in terms of millimeters with zero decimal degrees and the number without units which is the font sizes and pieces we will have uh, two decimal places so that is set as that so we click ok and we have set our working units so our project is now ready to be worked on